So we are getting super excited. I am getting super excited. It is Friday and from two weeks today, we are going to be leaving the UK. And we have been watching all these people down in Spain enjoying themselves in the sunshine. And uh, we... It, I'm going to come cl totally clean with you guys. We've kind of like never been to like Spain or Portugal or anywhere like that in the winter time. We're always, uh, we're always, we've always kind of been up in the mountains a little bit and always looking for that festive kind of like vibe. Um, but anyway, what has happened is the plan is well it's not changing because we are basically heading down that direction anyway but we were kind of like gonna try and stay back for christmas maybe in like mid france maybe bordeaux something like that but uh, st it's still gonna be um a little bit sort of like random we're gonna sort of go with the flow um yeah so i'm still stocking up my cupboards with all this lovely english food and um i've got the vinegar as well but um so yeah, I just thought I'd just mention the fact that we're just sort of champing it a little, a little bit of the bit, just to uh, sort of um, get some of that good weather. And uh, what kind of place keeps kind of like, it's like a magnet. Um, and we were actually talking about this last night, um, about a crazy place. And uh, that kind of crazy place, I'm gonna, ref I'm gonna do a little bit of reflection back to June and some other visits that we've done to the magical place called Benidorm. Okay, I'm gonna leave you with some great images and um, we're gonna sort of like just um, incorporate a little bit of the trip that we did back in June, a few little clips and some older stuff uh, in the video. And um, we've had some amazing times down La Costa Blanca. Absolutely immense. We actually rode a motorcycle all the way down there. Check the picture out. Um, and it was just a momentous time and it's it's very, very magnetic. Benidorm is a very magnetic place. The first person that mentioned to me years ago about going to Benidorm and I'm kind of like, What's it like, mate? You know, what's it, what's it kind of like? And he's like, mate, you need to go and check it out for yourself. So in the end, we did. And uh, we kind of like fell in love with it. I'm not going to say that I would stay down there for the eternity. But, um, you know, maybe uh, sort of like a week might be plenty long enough. But um, anyway, it is just the most magical place where everybody is smiling. Everybody is happy, um, and every occasion, we've just always bumped into the most wonderful people in Benidorm, and uh, everybody is, I, th I think the fact is, most people are actually on a vacation when they're at Benidorm, so everybody's normally 100% happy, and where in the where can you go to a place like that and literally find so many people that are like the same kind of vibe as everybody everybody is just up for the giggle do you know what i mean so and we kind of love that so we actually are looking forward to getting back down to benedorm <laughs> so uh, on with the glasses oh but um yeah so uh, basically that is kind of like on the plan so whether we're going to be down there um actually over Christmas period but we are definitely going to be down there for possibly the New Year period um, like I say it's going to be a little bit random um, it's I, I don't want to go tearing off down and uh, sort of like do them big shunts because we are going to go from the top of France don't forget but um, and uh, I've got a little bit of an itinerary on I've not really talked about my itinerary but like I say the uh, the sort of plan would be to get down probably uh, Bordeaux region and maybe um, have a, maybe a Christmas time around that kind of like area where they've still got like Christmas markets so we can get that vibe going because um, we didn't want to sort of like miss we do like that vibe and didn't like I said before we didn't want to like 
miss that vibe. Um, so I'm going to, uh, so we'll just, I just wanted to put this video out there and uh, I'm talking about sort of like the Heartbreak Hotel, the Detona Bar, all them great bars, the Calif Californian Beach Bar, one of our favourite places, the entertainment in Benidorm. What's your favourite, what is your favourite pub to go to in Benidorm? Uh, well, there is so many bars in Benidorm that, um, and so many, so much entertainment going on. Um, I just wanted to sort of like, just yeah, leave a comment, your best bar, what is your best bar in Benidorm? What is giving you the best vibe of Benidorm? And uh, what do you love about Benidorm? Uh, and like I said, we just love the people, the craziness, and uh, it's full on. And we'll see you soon. Okay, I'm gonna leave you with the images of the video. Like permanent caravans here. Um, we've bumped into several people already, and uh, yeah, one old guy he was telling us that he's actually uh, living here full time now. So there's obviously a lot of uh, full time people living here, but um, we are happy bunnies. Just down here by them palm trees down there is the uh, the bar and the pool complex, and it looks incredible. Um, oh, and another guy and his wife was uh, actually talking to us earlier on, um, and they were saying, uh, "Do you like Roy Orbison, Chalk?" And we're like, well, yeah, we're a pretty woman and all that sort of stuff. So he said, I've got Roy Orbison on tonight, like, you know, and I'm like, bloody bang on, mate. You go and enjoy yourself. <laughs> And you don't even need a foot pump. Wait, we've had a shower and the shower blocks are amazing. Loads of showers, really hot, beautiful, endless amounts of water. Um, I will be changing my t-shirt in a bit when Caroline's sorted herself out. <laughs> I need a clean t-shirt. But um, in the meantime, I just saw a guy walking past with some uh, a nice big case of beer. So I'm gonna go down and check the supermarket out and uh, see what the crack is. Already rum. There is like a litre bottle for 20 euros. We'll have a bottle of that and uh, I'm gonna pick up some beer. So the next thing, what are we gonna go? Oh, uh, so what are we gonna go for? Should we go for a San Miguel, I reckon? Let's go Spanish. Yeah, we're gonna get a slab of San Miguel. Sinatra's, um, Cabaret Show. Oh, uh, that Ian? Yeah, brilliant. Of course. Collapse. It's the Rock and Roll House. Look at this. So we have a bit of music going on in there, all the looks of it. Loads of it. Oh yeah. Rock and roll house. And uh, it's not a bad view this morning. Out across here. 
off the beach. Oh, look at this, lovely. bright shirt and let's see what happens what night is it it's wednesday night isn't it wednesday. wednesday night camping villamore let's go and do it <laughs> no sir it's a mo hotel adventures on youtube <laughs> Now, so some great uh, colours emerging tonight. Yeah, we're kind of heading over to the. I think we're going to go for Hotel California over the other side of the road. Let's go over and have a look.